from anti-aircraft fire with the flak jacket, made of steel plates sewn into nylon. During the Korean and Vietnam Wars, ground soldiers wear modified flak jackets, but armor's age-old dilemma of weight versus mobility makes them problematic. Yes, they could stop some projectiles coming at you, but they were incredibly heavy and bulky. Soldiers uh, who had to maneuver, that is, soldiers who were out on patrol, found them to be so much of a detriment that often they would take them off. The search continues for a revolutionary form of body armor that is bulletproof and lightweight. In the 1970s, a DuPont scientist invents the solution, not for the Pentagon, but for police officers. The answer is Kevlar, a synthetic fiber that by weight is five times as strong as steel. It's so strong and lightweight that it was originally used to replace steel belting in racing tires. Kevlar is a game changer for bulletproof vests in that it gives you stopping power, but more importantly, it's light. It allows the person to finally um, wear this sort of new version of a suit of armor, but still be relatively